Alright YouTube, welcome back. This is Zero, and it is time to get in to Dragon Quest Heroes, the World's Tree Woe, and the Blight Below. I want to thank you guys for peeing here, and all the support you've been giving me. Hit that like if you want to see some more. Let's get into this adventure. We go ahead and create a new log. Alright, let's go. Alright, if we need to pick a character, definitely you going with Lucius. Um, Alright, I'm going to go ahead and just stick with our name. I want to keep the kind of Dragon Quest character uh, theme going. I, don't, I appreciate the old games and want to just continue with them. No reason to change it. I know this is a little different. It's definitely Dynasty Warriors style. Um, are you happy to go ahead and create an adventure log for these two heroes? Yes. Alright, so we have to configure some settings. Might as well show everything to you guys, because that is the best. Alright, all that stuff on, autosave on, online features off. Dodge R1 or R2, we're going to go with R2 is probably a better dodge. I'm not sure how that's going to work. Uh, we'll keep it in English. Now, all of the text at the bottom of the screen is going to be throughout this walkthrough. If you guys uh, miss something, or you know, just pause it. Uh, Alright, so we'll do the quick... Quick and normal. Can I go ahead and confirm? This is going to be very Dynasty Warriors stylish. So it's Dragon Quest characters, Dragon Quest world, all the lore, and Dynasty Warriors style adventure. So I, I think it's a cool way to bring an old adventure back. I wouldn't mind a traditional RPG, but this doesn't seem like it's going to be too bad. Once upon a time, in a curious dimension, quite unlike our own, there was a very special world where humans and monsters lived together in peace. In the majestic city of Arba, which stood at the center of that world, the most important festival of the year was just beginning. And the streets resounded with the happy cries of man and monster alike. Hmm. Childishly simple. The prize is as good as mine. Not bad at all. All right, my turn. All I have to do is hit something, right? Should be easy enough. have never attacked humans before. Why now? And how many? Could they all have been affected? What? Even Helix, you mean? <sighs> Helix! Oh, thank goodness. He looks like he's okay. But the castle may not be. Our comrades are under attack. We must act now, lest they suffer for our complacency. Listen carefully. I will circle around to the rear of the castle and assess the situation. You, meanwhile, will approach from the you front... You want to follow some long-winded plan? Thanks, uh. but no thanks. We're royal guards, so let's guard some royals. We need to find King Doric right now. Huh? Wait! <sighs> Headstrong fools. Does she mean to fight them all off on her own? 
All right, I like her. She knows what's going on. And it's time to get down and dirty. All right, Arbra. Alright guys, so the graphical is, uh, this graphics are very nice. The cutscenes so far and the stories, very good. It's gonna be like a little tutorial session, that's fine, part one. Okay, we got a lot, Inferno Slash, R1, hold, with, uh, square. Oh, nice. Pretty cool. Monsters here already. Then we have little choice. We must fight our way through. If this ends up being very Dynasty Warriors like, which it kind of looks like, I think it's going to be a, a hit because the graphics are sweet. I love the cartoon look. I love the uh, Dragon Quest kind of universe. So, oh, very cool. Very cool. You gotta love Helix, man. I love his voice. to the door to get it going. If you can't go through something, go over it. Try jumping. Eat! Slide it is! Don't like throwing the spells from far away. So watch out! Don't panic if you think a spell's going to hit you. Just dodge out of the way. Alright, I don't know if I should have mapped R2. Did the dodge with uh, R1, but we'll go with it for now. I might change that. I think that actually looks like a better way to go. Onward to the throne room. Trying to get through this as quick as possible, but it looks like it's kind of timed on the dialogue. So. Inferno Slash! These monsters are going down! Still got a few more. Oh, I'm getting that chest. I am digging Helix. Just go up to it and stand still until you see the button sign. That is a sweet voice for Helix. You know what I'm going to do? I don't want to skip the event. Didn't know if we could go right into options. The music for the game is set a little high, so I apologize for that if it sounds weird right now. I will be lowering that. I don't think we can get to... Oh, settings. Volume settings. Alright, there we go. Alright. Better, better. 
I apologize if that was too high at the start. I, I think it was too high. It seems the threat here has been suppressed. Some magic, some health. Come on, Helix. If the sellers are anything to go by, a sizable force awaits us within the castle. I'm starting to get really worried about the king. We've got to hurry. <laughs> what is the meaning of this? Your Majesty! Ah, there you are, my brave young bodyguards. Our monster friends have gone quite mad. The little devils all turned on me at once. Both the castle and the town have been overrun. We must devise a strategy without delay. Mm. Mm. Uh, right. You and I must stand fast while His Majesty and Helix fall back toward the throne. The task of defending the throne room will be ours. When the enemy draw near, one of us will meet their advance and launch a counter-offensive. The other will hold position and protect King Doric from any who make it through the onslaught. But even if we do defeat the enemy before us, we cannot afford to let our guard drop. If my assessment of the situation is correct, they will divide their forces into several groups and attack in waves. Each time they do so, one of us must guard his majesty while the other renews the onslaught. By alternating our roles, we shall be able to conserve energy and keep the enemy at bay indefinitely. Really? Only... He's still talking. Thanks for the master plan, but if it's all the same to you, <laughs> so I'm going to go and batter those monsters before they get to the king. Why are you... To rush in without a sound strategy is pure folly. <laughs> <laughs> you are most kind. But I have no need of your protection. Nay, let we three stand and fight side by side. Now to arms, friends. For armor! <sighs> 